Do you think this is a real phone camera? No, nope, it's a prototype. Let's learn how you can make camera interactions with Protopi. First, add a camera layer. Then, adjust the size. The camera hasn't been opened yet. If you want to turn it on as soon as you open the prototype, go to the right-hand panel and check the Auto Start box. And just like that… Done! Unbelievable, right? Now, let's send the prototype to Protopi Player for review. Using your camera for interactions has never been easier. To make more interactions, such as taking a picture or switching camera, you need to change the camera response. Select the camera layer as the object of the camera response. If you want to take a picture, click on the Stop action. If you click Start, you can turn on the current camera or switch between the front and the rear camera. Now, let's make a real prototype together using your camera. If you tap a button within your prototype, it will behave as your phone camera. So, the first trigger is tap. Then, we need to add a camera as a response. As we saw before, we need to select the stop action to take a picture. For the second trigger, let's choose tap with the object being this circular arrow. In order to switch between the front and rear camera, you want to add camera response and then click start with switch here, like we did before. Now, let's try it on your phone. Here we go! Say cheese, everyone! With this camera feature, you can easily make all these amazing interactions. See you in the next tutorial.